What's up guys? GPS Ramp here. Back with The Walking Dead. Uh, we last left off on um, the drugstore where we were trying to get banished from Larry. But he, um, he did not succeed because Kenny saved us. So we moved on to the motel where we saved Glenn. And we were trying to save that girl, but she uh, didn't make it out. So let's just continue with where we left off. But yeah, I figured I was like, uh, if my if my um controller dies, I could just probably just zoom into the next video of just maybe Lego short video. But I don't know, whatever. So we're moving all the bodies from when we last came, and, um, God, there's Lily. She gets really crazy. Okay, there's Doug, Kenny, and Katja. Oh, he's looking at the photo of his family. Let me zoom in a little bit. There we go. So I'm just trying to make it adjustable for you guys. Let's go check in with everybody. Dude, no. Don't do this. <sighs> God, Lily's so mad. She kind of gets mad easily. Damn, Glenn. And if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. They go from upstairs. Well, she didn't really give up. She just didn't want to be one of them, and she thought the easy way out would just be to. Well, actually, she did kind of give up, actually, in a way. But she didn't really give up in the full extent. It's more complicated, but. I don't think she gave up because she wanted hope for herself, but she just didn't know how to get it because she was just so depressed. But what's done is done. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, yeah you're right. Hey, what about Clement Yeah. Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. We did. I still think that's true, but after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, the two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kim. You got it. Let's see how everyone else is doing. Let's check in on Carly. How are you doing, Carly? I'm okay. Considering. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he is such a. It's just that. I think that I like him. I'm sorry, Carl. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. Wait, hmm? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. 
I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Yeah, if only the walkers didn't get in through the window at that time. Maybe we could have helped Doug, but it is what it is, so. Let's check out on Clementine and Doug. Oh, watch this. Watch this fucking guy. He's just watching us. Oh, I hate Larry, dude. I hate Larry. Fuck Larry. <laughs> Yeah, Larry's kind of an asshole. But. No, it's not that. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be sorry. Can you imagine if it's like, so it's just a walkie talkie? I don't understand how. I don't understand how Glenn can. Let me pause this for a minute. The reason why I don't understand why Glenn can, um, or why, um, Clementine. The reason why I can't understand why Clementine was talking to her parents through the radio is because why wouldn't she just talk to them in person? But maybe that's a story for another time. But. Oh god, Doc. What do you want? Like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted oh, god. murderer. So will everyone else if you don't hear her. You hear me? Oh, shut up, Larry. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything, Daughter, or that little girl you've got with you. Watch your ass. <laughs> See what I mean, guys? He's an asshole. Lee, are you out of oh, God. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. My dad does this bit because of you. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Yeah. We're lucky to have you. I feel like we could have saved him, but I mean, it's a close call, so. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor is pretty damn dependable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch, we could stay here until the military rolls through. <laughs> and Kenny's always so helpful about military. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Oh, we get a premiere of what's coming next. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts being weak. You don't know me as well as Doug. I get that all the time. I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Oh, right. these guys. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John. This is gonna be the next time you guys see these guys. These guys are just bad news. You choose the kids this time. Something's coming. Oh boy. Ooh, everything's going to be okay. Trophy earns. Lied to her, she'll you in 54% honest. 
You and 48% chose Sean. Oh, wow. The other people chose Duck, really? Uh, 54% defended Kenny, gave Irene the gun, 47%. Oh, wow. Uh, 49% chose Carly. Oh, wow. Man. Uh, I don't own rights to this music, guys, so, um... I'll put that in the description below. But this is going to be every episode with this ending, with this song, so... Let's remember... This is the... Thing... This is something I'm going to have to add into the comments. Or not in the comments, in the description. Jeez. If only there was a way to skip it. Yeah, but what do you guys think about Larry? I mean, he's not the greatest guy, but, you know, he's got, eh, I don't know. These guys coming up are pretty bad, but Larry's still pretty good. Larry's still pretty bad. Um, I wouldn't put anything past Larry of being too bad, but he is pretty low on my list. In my opinion. So you go, you, you wanna, you wanna, you wanna talk to my daughter, Lee? You, you wanna risk yourself in this group? Oh god, Fortnite updated, Jesus. Why do I even have that game on my server still? Oh yeah, yeah. I haven't played that game in like, a couple months. I wanna say maybe like two or three. I do kind of miss it, but I don't at the same time, because it wasn't that fun. I don't know, it takes up a lot of space on my PS5. Holy. I'm going to actually give you guys a recap. Um, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that, actually. Um, so, I want to show you guys... No, I don't want to go too far ahead, actually. I forgot how crazy this game is. And this is just the beginning, guys. We're not even into the intense stuff yet. I mean, we are, but we're not. But, like, we are going to have to wait for episode two. Um, so this is going to be uh, kind of a short video tonight. But um, I know it wasn't too uh, exciting. But, yeah, Larry's kind of a dick. But we're not going to worry about him. But, um, yeah, what I have to worry about now is the next episode, which we're going to get to tomorrow night. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, let me know in the comments what you guys thought of the gameplay of episode one. Uh, let me know if you guys want me to make any changes in episode one. If you guys think I should save Sean or if I should go back and save Duck. Um, I did want to get on Herschel's good side because I did save Duck one time. We were kicked out anyway, so I guess either way, we're going to get kicked out of Herschel's farm. But, um, stay tuned for next episode, which will be tomorrow night. Uh, like I said, like this video if you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe if you guys are new. Thank you guys for up subscribed. And, uh, thank you guys for all the support. And I will see you guys in the next video of Walking Dead, episode 2.